One hour later. Is it Monday already? Hey guys, Jacob here. Welcome to the very first Speak My Mind Monday, or SMM M, as I have on this board. So basically what Speak My Mind Monday is, I get a, f uh, a few topics to talk about and just say what like maybe my experiences are, something like that. So today I only have one since it's the very first episode and I'll see how everyone likes it. So cameraman AJ, what is the topic for today? Thank you. Today the topic is talking to people. And as I said in my very first, uh, in the episode on back on Wednesday, on the 1st of August, I, um, this is something really good for me. Um, I want to quickly rephrase that. It's not something I'm completely proud about just because it's not a very good topic in a way. Um, okay, anyways, let's get right into this. Talking to people can be very different. It can be if you're talking something, talking just to friends in general. It can be also if you're just trying to help someone out by talking to them. Sometimes even just listening if you need to. So I'm a very shy person. Uh, I'm 16 now and uh, when I was a kid I would barely talk. I feel like some people thought I was mute. I was so untalkative, I, I couldn't talk to my parents at times. I couldn't talk to my family at times because I was so shy. I'm a, I've uh, definitely broken out of my little shell now, but I'm still definitely, I consider myself an introvert. If you don't know what an introvert is, a person predominantly concerned with their own thoughts and feelings rather than with external things. In other words, an introvert will like maybe rather stay inside or um, that rather than like go to a party or something like that. They, a lot of the time introverts have hard time expressing their words um, and they can like do things like write write their words on paper a lot of the time. It's something. It's the whole thing. I consider myself an introvert, to be to be an introvert. I don't have the best um, ability to talking um, when I have, when I go to like uh, social gatherings or when I hang out with a lot of my friends. I like to go home and stay quiet a lot of the time. I like to go into my room and just be to myself, basically. So for a long time, I've had trouble talking to people, and I've considered myself a listener. If people are talking to me about their problems, I really listen more than I'm able to actually talk, like to gather words and everything, to try to say something to help them with this problem. And I don't just mean like problems, maybe they have math homework problems or anything like that. I can easily do that. That's, I like math, I can get that across. It's with problems like depression. And a really good thing to me, um, this is a tip. If you want to take any tips from these videos, if you want to take me seriously whatsoever, a tip I have, if you're trying to talk to someone, try to convey it in a way that you know how. For example, I was talking to a friend, uh, she didn't think there was a purpose for her in life anymore, and she's had this depression for a while. She's a really great friend, and I would never want to lose her. I I don't know what, what clicked in my mind, but all of a sudden I just started to type something out about like a role-playing game. Uh, I can give an example how I see life, I see it as you're just one big role-playing video game and each year on every one of your birthdays that's a level that's when you go up a level me being 16 I would be on level 16 in this game of life and when you pass away you log out of the game for good so how I see it she has been having trouble with demons for a long time and some of them she's scared she can't fight against by herself. She doesn't want to bother a lot of people about it. And I know she is strong enough. I know this is getting really um, into things, but I'm, I'll get out of it a little bit in, in a little bit. How I think of this, if you think of it as a role-playing game standard, 
Uh, these demons are enemies that you have to fight to get experience so you can level up. Some demons are easier than the other ones, and so some you can be on your own, some you need your teammates or allies to help you defeat if you don't think you're strong enough. If you can't defeat something, you shouldn't just rage quit and log out for good and die. I think there's always a purpose if you're th if you think about it again on on this game standard some quests just come to you and some you have to find by talking to thing your allies and these NPC characters that seem like they're just set in stone there for to talk to you and glitch out and they they seem like they're pointless. I figured out that night I've improved a lot. I'm not as shy as I used to be. I can talk to people now. It's a lot easier than I used to be able to. Even with me, I tried to talk to myself out of things and sometimes it works. Sometimes I need other people to help me. Like all my friends and family. To get out of the more down in the dumps part, and I don't mean to be, but it's just a true thing that we all have to deal with in life. Um, to get out, to get a little more out of that and back just onto the topic of talking. For some people, it's really hard and, um, for me, it's really hard to convey my thoughts sometimes. Um, I have to actually think to gather my thoughts in a way. I have this weird thought process. Some people f have the same thought process. I haven't met really anyone who has the same as me. Maybe AJ. I have to visually think like, I have to make a mental image of how I'm going to do something or how to explain something to be able to tell someone something. When people get annoyed at me for not being able to explain something, I just tell them I'm thinking and I don't say anything else, but I just think, why don't they wait for me to think sometimes? I know some, some people take five seconds to think or some people take Hey guys, so, uh, this is Editing Jacob. Sorry about the technical difficulties. I didn't realize that the camera had stopped recording before I finished the video. Um, so I'm just here to end this off really fast. So basically what I was going to say, some people, a lot of people take more time than others to think. Like, I have to take a while sometimes to think about exactly what I'm going to say. So I just want to put a little moral of this. If you have friends who are going through something, talk to them. And if you have people like me who take a little bit of time to say what they're going to say, just give them time to think because it's better for them to be able to say exactly what they wanted to say rather than be rushed and not be able to say everything. So... Um, thank you for watching, uh, like always, um, leave a rating, possibly, um, comment, and share if you want, that would really help, possibly get some more people viewing, more, just some more people to my channel, and subscribe if you want to see some more content from me, so, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video, see you guys. Three! Two, four, three, two, one, zero, nine, ten, eleven, one, action! <laughs> okay.